I'm sturdy, and this is the Road Trip Special Edition, one, two minute, maybe three minute, beer review with my friend, the Freak, Frankie Paul. Whoa! Freak, what are you doing? What's up, sturdy? You told me to get comfortable. Well, yeah, I didn't really mean that comfortable, but okay, it is what it is. You're lucky I have my pants on. Unlike Key West, you run around everywhere without pants, so... You ready to go road tripping, freak? Let's get this done. All right, man, let's go. Me and the freak are going to head to State Line and go grab some beers. We'll take you on our little road trip on the special edition road trip beer review. Let's get freaky. Freak, you ready to go? I'm absolutely ready. Let's go do this, brother. Uh, freak, I don't think you're dressed to go out in public. You got your going out shirt? Got my going out shirt. Clearly, you were wearing your sweet ass going out hat and your going out sunglasses. You got your going out mask? I got my going out mask. That's a sweet ass mask from Reverend Boots down in Dewey Beach. Freak, you look like you're getting ready to go hold up a liquor store or a bank. You got your going out firearm? I got my going out strap. I was kind of joking. What are we going to steal with that thing, Freak? We're going to steal the ladies' hearts. Uh, okay, but you need to bring a firearm for that? It's like my penis. I don't leave home without it. Uh, well, you know what? Who am I to judge? Freak, you ready to go beer shopping, man? Let's go drink some beers. We're going to go drink some beers. And play with some guns. No, we're going to put the guns up because guns and beers don't mix. We're responsible drinkers and responsible firearm owners. Let me strap this up back in the case. Hey, Freak, you ready to go wander into uh, State Line Liquors and go see what they got? I was born ready. I don't know where the Freak is going. I'm just following him. Uh, should we take it back to the old school and look in the malt liquor section? I got UFO white. Hey, Freak, what do you got there, man? I got something called Two Spoons, please. Let's not confuse it with Two Girls, One Cup. When we're out and about, we try and follow the social rules correctly. Hey, Freak, do you believe in social distancing? I do not believe in social distancing. I or these stupid fucking masks. Fair enough. Hey. Little quick edit here. At the end of that clip, you can hear the guy yell, Hey! Which he followed with, Put your mask on, Freak! Fuck that guy. Yeah, but Freak put the mask on. Because he was a kid that was just making a few bucks. I don't want to knock out anybody while wearing a pink shirt. Wait a minute. I saw that happen in Key West. I'm sturdy. And I'm the Freak. And this is the... 35-minute road tripping beer review. Oh, my. On the special edition, 35-minute beer review with Sturdy and the Freak, we have... UFO White and Two Spoons, please. Again, don't confuse it with two girls, one cup. Wait a minute, I thought it was two spoons, one cup. Two spoons, please. They're very polite about it. <laughs> Fucking America. No shit. Well, look at the head on that. Uh. I don't know how I'm going to follow that. Oh, I know how I'm going to follow that. All right, Freak, what do you think? I think it tastes like a hoe garden. You know where I plant my bitches at. You heard the Freak's review. Here's mine. That's a pretty tasty beer. Like a woman that admits she's wrong, a leprechaun and a unicorn, that's hard to find. Stick around. We'll be back with two spoons, please.
I think he said a leprechaun and he meant a leprechaun. Two, Utah. Meh, maybe. We're reviewing two spoons, please, from Manor Hill Brewing out of Ellicott City, Maryland. Pint glasses still get no mercy here. You son of a bitch beer, you making me work for this? Making me work for this? Freak, this is unacceptable. Man. Those are some dark chocolate beers. 11% alcohol by Manor Hill Brewing. I don't even know how this is going to end. I know how this is going to end. Probably, probably wrong. Holy shit, Freak, you look like you've been enjoying these beers way too much, my friend. Two spoons, please, Freak, what'd you think? Two spoons, please? It was like a wet, tasty orgasm in your mouth. Almost better than sex. Almost? Almost. A good dessert beer. Oh, man. Two spoons, please, by Manor Hill. I can only imagine that when Augustus Gloop fell in the chocolate river, that's exactly what the river tasted like. I would gladly jump in that river any day. My name's Sturdy. I've been hanging out with the freak. This has been the 35 or 12 or 6 second or like 4 day or I'm still wearing the same shirt. Gee, oh, god damn. Anyway, this has been the beer review on Poor Decisions, man. Thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.